Good morning, CCHS. I'm Chris Wilson here with Philip Nestler to bring you the daily announcements. Today is Wednesday, April 24th. It is an A-Day, day 143 of the school year. Today's quote comes from Peter Ducker. He says, the best way to predict the future is to create it. For lunch today, we will be dining on goulash with meat, fresh lettuce salad, mixed fruit, French bread, and milk. Let's take a look at the standing announcements. Seniors, keep checking the scholarship list. Several deadlines are approaching. It's time for new member applications of YAC, Youth Answering the Call of the Community. Freshmen that are going to the sophomore to be sophomores need to apply. Check your email and their Facebook page for the application. January Drivers Ed class, you will have class on tonight from 6.30 to 9.30 p.m. to finish up the session. See Mitchard Jameson with questions. Sign up for driver's ed for this summer. Registration deadline is May 3rd. Sign up is in the office. Students taking classes at SWIC for the first time next year will be taking the AccuPlacer at SWIC the morning of Thursday, May 2nd. Specific information has been emailed to the students involved. Paper copies of the details are available in the guidance office. The representative from Upper Iowa University will be in the guidance office today at 2 p.m. to talk to with interested students. Richard Mullins 3A class will go to second lunch today. High school cheerleading tryouts for football, basketball, and wrestling cheerleading positions for the 2019-2020 school year will be held in May. Any 8th grade through 11th grade students interested in trying out should plan to attend practice on Saturday, May 4th from 1 to 5 p.m. Please wear shorts and a t-shirt for practice. Tryouts will then be held on Sunday, May 5th at 2.30 p.m. Plan to meet in the high school commons both dates. Preston 2019-20 Color Guard and Winter's Guard Edition practices will start on Wednesday, May 1st. Practices will be at the middle school gym starting at 6.45 a.m. Anyone interested in being a part of the guard and have questions, please see Mr. Peters or Mrs. Peters. The preseason softball meeting is Sunday, April 28th at 4.30 p.m. in the high school library. This is mandatory if you plan on playing softball this summer. Plan accordingly. That is all we have for the standing announcements. Let's send it over to take a look at the seminar schedule. Today, during seminar, there will be a Panther rally in the gym. Students are encouraged to wear blue for autism awareness. We will take a class photo at the rally. Next week, we'll need the seniors to come into the classroom during seminar to film their portion of segments for the college decision week. Seniors, check your email for details. That's all we have on the seminar schedule. Let's take a look at the activity calendar. Let's take a look at the results from last night's competitions. Tomorrow, the JV boys golf team will travel to Carroll for the Kemper Catholic Tournament. Athletes need to be dismissed at 1 for a 115 bus. Competition will start at 4. The girls track and field team will travel to Carlisle for their meet. Athletes need to be dismissed at 115 for a 130 bus. The field events will start at 415. The girls tennis team will host Shenandoah. The duel will start at 430 at the Swick tennis courts. The boys tennis team will travel to Shenandoah to take on the Mustangs. Athletes need to be dismissed at 2 for a 2.15 bus. Tennis will start at 4.30. Kelsey Fields will be competing at Drake Relays and Discus, the top 24 athletes from around the state. All classes qualified based on their furthest throws of the season. Kelsey will throw the Discus at 4. Check the Creston Girls Track and Field Facebook page for updates on her progress. On Friday, Kelsey will be back in action at the Drake Relays as part of the 24-athlete field in the shot put. Kelsey will throw the shot put at 8.30 a.m. Check the Creston Girls Track and Field page for updates on her progress. The girls' tennis team will take on Clark at home. The meet will start at 4.15 at the Swick Tennis Courts. The boys' tennis team will travel to Clark to take on the Indians. Athletes need to be dismissed at 2.30 for a 2.45 bus. Tennis will start at 4.30. 
the girls' soccer team will travel to Denison to take on the Monarchs. Athletes need to be dismissed at 1.45 for a 2 o'clock bus. The varsity game will start at 5, followed by a plus half JV game at 6.30. The boys' track and field team will travel to Red Oak for their meet. Athletes need to be dismissed at 2.45 for a 3 o'clock bus. Field events will start at 5. Saturday, the girls' soccer team will travel to West Central Valley for their tournament. The start time is still to be determined. The boys' tennis team will travel to Atlantic for a tournament. The tournament will start at 9. The boys' soccer team will travel to Pella for their soccer tournament. Athletes need to catch a 7 o'clock a.m. bus. Game will start at 9.30. That is all we have for the activities calendar. We will send it back to the newsroom to wrap up the announcements. Happy birthday to Harley Lewis, Alexa Still, and Maddie Fry. And as always, have a great day and always remember to respect yourself, others, in this place.